Michigan spent the team's first full day here in Houston, getting ready and getting a taste of what's to come on Monday night for the national championship. The Wolverines opened the day face to face with reporters, answering questions at media day. And then the top ranked team in the country went inside NRG Stadium for the team's final practice of this long season. Everything the Wolverines have worked for and not shied away from saying they wanted is right in front of them. The goal is to win the national championship, nothing less. It was always, you know, for us, Houston or bust. And I even said it, I believe it was back in February at uh, one of the Michigan basketball games, you know, and I got had the mic in front of the Chrysler Arena. And I told the fans, like, I promise you we're going to win a national championship. And we haven't done it yet, so we have to make sure we just stay locked in this week. Yeah, well, I thought it was possible. I mean, uh, you know, right then and there, right when we walked off that field, uh, you know, right when J.J. said we would be back, I thought it was possible. And then to watch the repetition every day of what our guys were, were doing, how they, how they went right to back to work, what our guys do on a daily, weekly, monthly basis, speak so loudly. Everything that we've done to get here, uh, we're continuing to do the same thing. So I think we keep the same approach and, you know, treat it as, you know, obviously it's the national championship, but it's a football game at the end of the day. We got to go out there and execute each and every play. And, you know, that's how we're treating it right now. Harbaugh said when he arrived here after the long flight from Michigan that he fell asleep before the flight even took off. With his feet fully on the ground now and about 48 hours away from kickoff, preparation, he said, will go through to the last minute. Rest has been a big part of what the Wolverines have learned from the last two trips to the CFP. This time, there's an extra game and one final chapter to add to the storybook season. In Houston, Brad Galley, 7 Action Sports.